how's it going everybody and welcome to another tutorial video today I'm going to show you guys something that has been highly requested in my channel ever since I started doing thumbnails and that is where to find fonts or what are the best free fonts to use in thumbnails or what are your favorite fonts in general so in my last video I got a couple questions about uh, where to where I get my fonts or if I have any suggestions So if you struggle with finding fonts or just simply want to know where I get mine This is the video for you. So I'm gonna show you guys Two different websites that I like to get my fonts from so the very first website is probably the best one out of the two That is gonna be the font.com So this uh, website has thousands of fonts that you can download. Some of them are 100% free, and other ones require you to make a donation, or some of them are just for um, personal use, as in you're not supposed to profit from them unless you have a license. But I'm gonna recommend you some of my favorite free fonts in this video. I mean, there's nothing wrong with using uh, personal fonts, it's just that if you are, I would recommend either getting a license or messaging the the creator of the font. So usually when you download a, a font, there should be some contact information that you can hit up the person. But this video is going to be about free fonts. So for thumbnails, my favorite two categories are either cartoon or comic in the fancy and then if you go to basic you can go to sans serif or serif these two are my favorite when it comes to thumbnails as well as these two over here for logos so we're gonna go check in cartoon and you guys can see we have a very big selection of fonts so what I like to do is I like to sort them you can sort them by name popularity or newest I usually search uh, sort them by name since if you search them by popularity you're always gonna see the same ones in the at the beginning so if you sort by name you're gonna go through right here and just look at fonts that you like as you guys can see there's hundreds of options you can go right at least for right here now it has 97 pages of fonts so I'm gonna just quickly choose a font that I like uh, like this one for example right here it's a pretty good font uh, I'm not sure if it has different variations I, I don't think so so we're gonna find another font that I like to use and let's see this one right here is amazing Andrew Hedge I like it I like it a lot I would definitely recommend this one let's click on it and it is going to show us pretty much just the generic stuff usually with free fonts you're not gonna have like for characters like you're not gonna have like the plus or minus or stuff like that just because it's a free it's like a free font so it takes more effort to create all these but I mean this is just amazing you know I'm gonna download it I already have it but I'm just gonna download it all right so what I'm gonna do is now that we found one in this category we're gonna go to comic which is another one of my favorite categories you guys can see this has like a lot of like cartoony like pretty wide text and font which is very like good for logos and thumbnails as well you know you can use one that looks pretty good like these are some very thick and like I'd say round fonts that are really good another one of my favorite is a uh, sans serif this is really good like it's got really clean like this one right here I love this font I don't have it but I'm right now that I'm looking at it it looks really nice I really I really like this font you can just scroll here for like honestly I, I sometimes feel like it's an addiction you know you just go through and through and through and you just download as many fonts as you want because this is a good source and I highly um, recommend this page you won't get a virus I mean don't quote me on that but I've downloaded this for over five years and I've never gotten a virus from this website so it's pretty safe so if in case you already knew about this website I'm gonna show you guys something that a lot of people don't actually know that there's actually good fonts there so if you guys know what Behance is you guys shall see Behance is sort of it's like a, an Adobe portfolio so if you have if you have um, your uh, whatchamacallit if you have um, Adobe Photoshop or Illustrator you can create a free account with them 
and it allows you to post your work as you guys can see this is my portfolio it's not updated to my current work I mean I did up uh, work on this like a couple months ago but I have lots of work that I need to work on updating but as you guys can see I'm not signed in uh, I'm not gonna sign in for this but the reason why I want to show you guys the website you guys might be thinking oh what is, why are you showing us a portfolio well it has a search bar right here and if you go to the search bar and you type in free fonts you're gonna be amazed by the amount of fonts that you can find on this website oh, there we go all right so as you guys can see there's a lot of good fonts here and a lot of them are free free to use for example fonts that I have used from here let me see if I can find one I definitely have this uh, Baron font I don't know if that's how you pronounce it five of sans is a really good font I really recommend this one let's see another font that I have from here Oh, they've actually updated a lot of fonts because a lot of these fonts I don't remember seeing them like you guys can see they are constantly updating this or even if they're not updating they're refreshing the list so like maybe you missed out on a font you can just check it out right here like see there's this is an amazing place to get fonts from and a lot of them are for free if you guys see like oh Cunha that's an amazing font I've used this so many times for thumbnails highly recommend this font if you are um, wanting to do thumbnails this is a very good font and it's completely free so yeah this is a pretty good website I mean a lot of people don't know about this and I just wanted to share it with you guys because it, it really does help so what I'm going to do is um, I'm gonna have a folder with my favorite fonts to use uh, that I can share with you guys that are free so if this video gets I'd say like I know it's hard but if it gets like 50 likes I will share my fonts with you guys not all of them of course because I have a lot but like my top 20 fonts Unisans amazing font I highly recommend I'm definitely gonna put that there but if you guys want to have a, a folder of all my favorite fonts I'm gonna put a, a download link in the description once this video hits 50 likes so if you're really if you're like a designer or you're someone that just wants to do work for yourself you don't want to pay someone to do it you can definitely do them yourself uh, all I ask is if you guys like the video leave some comments and suggest a tutorial for next week I don't know if I say next week but it may be like two three weeks from now I've just been extremely busy but I just want to thank you guys so much for the support on the previous video that was amazing and if you have any suggestions on what you guys want to see next week like I said make sure you let me know so with that being said thank you guys for watching and you already know the drill just 50 likes and you have a folder with at least 20 fonts that I prefer so with that being said not gonna make this any longer and hope you guys have a good one